Hi, this is Dr. David Green, founder and CEO of R3 Stem Cell. Today the topic is, what type of stem cell therapy should you have? Now, we know that all these different types of stem cell therapies on the market today work well. For instance, amniotic stem cell therapy, bone marrow derived, and adipose derived as well. Okay, but there are two different ways that I tend to look at individuals by their chronologic age versus their physiologic age. All right. Well, what's the difference? Well, chronologic is just time. If you're 60 years old, that means you were born 60 years ago. But that doesn't mean that you are physiologically 60 years of age. Here's the analogy that I like to use. Let's say that your name is Bert, and next to you, your neighbor is Bertha. All right. Your neighbors. You are both 65 years of age chronologically, meaning you were born 65 years ago. Okay. Now, Bertha is really healthy. She eats well. She's uh, her body mass index is right in line. Um, she exercises every day. She doesn't drink. She doesn't smoke. She's probably physiologically 10 years younger than her chronologic age. So she's 65. Physiologically, she's probably 55. That's what's important when you're looking at what type of stem cell therapy potentially to undergo. Now, Bert is really not a healthy man. He smokes three packs a day. He drinks like a um, fish. He uh, doesn't exercise. He sits on the couch all the time and eats um, Lay's potato chips. So he is physiologically much older than Bertha. He's probably more like 85 as opposed to 65. Okay. Now we know that um, as a person ages physiologically, that there are many less, much less stem cells in one's bone marrow than when someone is younger. So for instance, when you're born, one in 10,000 cells in your bone marrow is a stem cell. When you're 70, the average is one in 2 million. So if you're physiologically that age or older than that, it's probably not the most prudent decision to undergo a bone marrow derived stem cell treatment. By and large, all things, you know, other things being equal. Okay. So it may be prudent to consider either an adipose or a lot of people will go for an amniotic um, with a company like ours because it's a very consistent um, material. From one lot to the next, there's you know all kinds of cells, cytokines, growth factors. It's very consistent. All right, so you have to keep that in mind. Is your physiologic age is much 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 more important than your chronologic age? So visit us online today at r3stemcell.com. There's a ton of educational information on the site. Our YouTube channel has about a hundred videos in it. And then call us at eight four four get stem. We'd be happy to get you in with one of our centers of excellence for treatment. Thank you.